Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mohammad Soil, and today we are going to start Unit 5 from Industrial Pharmacy, that is Cosmetic. In this lecture, we'll see formulation and preparation of the following cosmetic preparation. First, we'll see lipstick. So, lipstick used to impart an attractive color and glossy moisture appearance to the lips. Lipstick is a cosmetic product containing pigment oils waxes and emollients that apply color texture and production to the lips although the name originally applied to the bottom that is stick of material within a tubular container usually around 10 mm in diameter and 50 mm in length the term has now generally transposed to the material itself regardless of method of application now coming to the ideal properties of lipsticks First, it should be non-toxic and non-irritant to the lips. Second, it should import uniform color to the area of application. Third, it should make lips soft. Fourth, it should have stability towards environmental condition. It should completely free from grittiness. And the last is, the container should operate easily. Now coming to the raw material used in lipstick. First, waxes. Second, oils. Third, pigment and dyes. Fourth, alcohol and fragrance. And last is preservatives and antioxidant. So these are used as a raw material for the preparation of lipstick. First, we'll see waxes. So wax provides the structure to the solid lipsticks. Lipsticks may be made from several waxes such as beeswax, ozecrite, and candelilla wax because of its high melting point. Carnauba wax is a key ingredient in terms of strengthening the lipsticks. Then second oils. It is the addition of oil that gives lipstick its shine and translucent effect. Different type of oils like castor oil, vegetable oil, lanolin oil and mineral oil are used in lipsticks. Third we'll see pigment and dyes. These are used in lipsticks to impart the desired color or shade to the lipsticks. The dyes used in lipstick include bismuth, oxychloride, manganese, violet, titanium dioxide, DNC red number 6 and DNC red number 21. Then alcohol and fragrance. Alcohol is used as a solvent for the wax and oils used in making lipsticks. Fragrance is used for imparting a pleasant scent. To the lipsticks and to mask the smell of other ingredients then last is preservatives and antioxidants preservative and antioxidant are added to the lipstick to increase its shelf life and to prevent it from becoming stale or rancid preservatives like methyl paraben propyl paraben and antioxidant is gallic acid propyl gallate bha and bht now coming to the manufacturing process of lipsticks. First color grinding, second melting and mixing, third molding, fourth flaming and fifth is packaging. Let's discuss one by one. First color grinding. Pigments and dyes are available in amorphous form. So we have to convert into powder form. Equipment used for grinding are roller mill and colloidal mill. Second mixing and melting first the raw material like solvent oil and waxy material are melted in separate stainless steel container the solvent and oils are mixed with color pigments then the mixture is passed through roller mill grinding the pigment to avoid grainy fill in lipsticks after the pigment mass is grounded and mixed it added to hot wax until uniform color and consistency is obtained then third molding once the lipstick's mass is mixed and free of air it is ready to be poured in tubes the melted mass is dispensed into a mold which consists of bottom portion of metal and a shaping tube lipstick is poured upside down so that bottom of tube is at top of mold any excess material is scraped out the lipstick is cooled and separated from mold and bottom of tube is sealed the lipstick is passed through flaming test 
to seal the pin holes and to give finish to the product. Then last is labeling and packaging. The lipstick is retracted and tube is capped. The lipstick is ready for labeling and packaging. Now coming to the defects, formulation related problem. First, sweating. It is caused due to high oil content or inferior oil binding. Second, bleeding. Separation of colored liquid from waxy bases. Third, blooming. Due to higher percentage of cetyl alcohol. Fourth, is streaking. It is expected to be caused due to titanium dioxide. Then molding related problems. First, lettering. Lipsticks does not look smooth or homogeneous. Second, deformation. Noticeable in software formula. Third, cratering. Now method of preparation of lipsticks. Take castor oil, linoleic oil and oil oil in a beaker containing dyes and pigments. Heat the above mixture up to 65 degrees Celsius in another beaker. Take remaining ingredient, heat it to 65 degrees Celsius, then add the contents of beaker A to beaker B by vigorous stirring. Then this solution is added to molds. Then how to evaluate it? First melting point, third breaking point, third force of application, fourth stability and fifth is microbial testing. First we will see melting point. Evaluation should be done to know the problem during handling and storage. The melting point should generally be above 50 degrees Celsius. Second breaking point. Breaking points of lipsticks should be evaluated for confirming strength of lipsticks. Third force of application. It is used to evaluate the value of force of to apply to surface. Fourth stability. It is an important evaluation parameter. Stability for long time and short time are evaluated. So this is the formulation and preparation of lipsticks. In next video we will see formulation and preparation of shampoos. Till time take care and bye bye. And if you people have not subscribed my youtube channel yet, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss any update from my youtube channel.